hi y'all so first i would like to apologize in advance for my hair my hair really needs to get done so bad but i'm really just not up to doing it right now but she really needs to get done she's just not looking good anymore and then for these glasses that i have on i've been looking for these glasses for so long but i found them today in one of my pockets of my jacket but i've been looking for these for so long i wanted to wear them one time but i just could not find them Hi, it's Kamel. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing a cozy night in. I really wish I could have filmed this video earlier. Kind of. I mean, it's fine about the time that I'm filming it now. But I feel like earlier in the day, around like 6 or so, where the sun was kind of setting, you know. But we're filming this at like 8 p.m., which is also fine too, I guess as long as i'm filming this you know so for the cozy night in i really wanted to do a fall movie night video idea but as i was doing my research for that video that video wasn't really searchable and nobody has really done that video which is honestly good but for that fall movie night video that video also would have been short so i would have had to add something else to it so we're gonna do a cozy night in video and for this cozy night in i plan on baking mini apple pies because i saw this recipe on pinterest so i want to do it um basically is a mini apple pies in the shape of little pumpkins like carved pumpkins and stuff and do our little movie and wherever else i come up and think of for this video that's what we're gonna do <laughs> So now it's time to make the mini apple pies and for the pastry dough you will need one and a fourth cup of flour, fourth cup of sugar, it's like a line, hold on, you will need a half a teaspoon of sugar a fourth teaspoon of salt but i didn't have a fourth teaspoon so i just sprinkled some salt in there you need half a cup or half tablespoon of ice water and one stick of cold butter the water got to be iced water and the butter got to be really cold also the recipe will be in the description since i'm messing it up but you see it on the screen okay also you can mix this by hand but i used a food processor because that would be easier and that's what the recipe i saw said to do and it was actually easier this way after it's done mixing it should look something like this like yellowish clumps and then the recipe i saw said put a fourth cup of ice water but honestly you don't even need the whole fourth cup i just sprinkled a little bit of ice water in there until it was able to combine and mix into dough I did put this in the fridge for a little bit, but after taking it out of the fridge, it was hard and hard to like knead the dough, so you will put it in the microwave for like a cute little second. Now let's make the filling. Now for the filling, you will need one apple, finely chopped into like little cubes, half a lemon, a fourth cup of brown sugar, a fourth cup of granulated sugar, as well as a fourth cup of water. You will put this on medium low heat and until it gets thick and resemble like a brown color, resemble caramel, but it won't exactly be caramel. And this is what it should look like. When rolling out the dough, you want to flour your surface as well as flour the top of the dough and flour your rolling pin so that way it don't stick. Then I cut out little pumpkin shapes. I didn't have a pumpkin cookie cutter so I just cut out the shapes with a knife. Then on one of the pumpkins, I cut little faces into it to resemble a carved pumpkin. Yeah. 
Then you're gonna put a little bit of your filling in the middle of the non-face cutout pumpkin dough, and you're gonna place the face one on top and crimp the edges with a fork. You can also do crimp the edges with your fingers. After that, I put on a simple egg wash on each one. The egg wash is nothing special. It's literally just a one egg mixed together. And then I put them in the oven at 350 for about 15 minutes. And here's what they look like. Some of it spilled out on the sides, but that's nothing but caramelized sugar. All right, y'all, so I finished the mini apple pies and here's what they look like. They look so cute and I already tasted the filling and tastes so good. But here's what they look like. I cut them in the shape of pumpkins and like a ghost. But I think they look so cute and so good. And I did try one already and it tastes good. I like it. This lighting is not good at all. I look so ashy and pale. But not. I don't know. But I'm also going to go do my skincare anyway. Anyways, so today all day I've just been doing schoolwork. Really, I've just been sitting at my desk all day, um, reading through my program's handbook, like my major in the handbook and how to get into the program. Because the sonography program is a selective program, as with any health major is a selective program, so only like a few people can enter. And there's only like 14 people allowed into the sonography program, the DMS program, which is the program that I'm in. So I'm reading the handbook and making sure I have all my requirements and all my things that I can do to enter into the program, which I meet all those requirements. However, I need one more thing and that is the SAT. So I took the SAT already, but I need to take it again because the score that I got previously is not really satisfactory for the program because um, the SAT score for the program needs to be above 1160 and I was under that so I need to retake the SAT to get um, at least 1160 or higher. So for these next few weeks until the SAT, well I have to register, register for it first, um, but for these next few weeks for the SAT I gotta really study and buckle down and study everything I can, use every resource I can to study for this SAT. Anyways, right now I'm about to journal and just do a brain dump journal prompt um, just to like, you know, empty my mind, empty my thoughts and just write it down just to clear my mind and my head before I go to sleep because you know when you got like an awake mind or like you're thinking about a lot of things, it's kind of hard to go to sleep. So we're in a journal before bed. With the fall times, it is time for fall movies, fall shows. Everyone has their favorite comfort show. Everyone has their favorite comfort movie, especially for the fall time, you know. So, we're going to find a fall movie to watch. Well, I would say my favorite fall movies are Halloween Town, Love It, Classic, Love Her. I also like The Nightmare Before Christmas. I also like The Corpse Bride. I also like, what's another one? Coraline. I also like Spookly. Oh, I also like Charlie Brown. He's a favorite and a classic. And yeah, I would say that's about it. Or that's all I can think of right now. But we're going to be watching Twitches tonight as our fall movie. Twitches is also a classic fall movie to watch. Twitches 1 and 2, you know, and it's just a comfort movie. Don't mind me. I can't find me I can't find me